In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called quotient of two functions advanced. We're given an f of x and a g of x, and we're asked first to find f divided by g. So I'll start just by saying that f divided by g is a quotient where in the numerator we would have f of x, which is here 6 over x, and in the denominator we would have the g function, which here is x minus 7. And since this is a complex fraction where we have a fraction within a fraction, I'm going to rewrite it as 6 over x, which is the numerator, instead of divided by x minus 7, I know that this is the same as multiplying by 1 over x minus 7. So our simplified function f over g would just be 6 in the numerator and x times x minus 7 in the denominator. This would be our quotient. However, we are also asked to give its domain using interval or union of intervals. And in the domain, we are looking to see if there are any values that x cannot be. And from this, I can say that the denominator here cannot be equal to 0. So that means that x times x minus 7 cannot be equal to 0. And the two values that would cause x times x minus 7 to be 0 would be first whenever x is 0, and the second would be whenever x minus 7 is 0. So I'm going to want to exclude x equals 0, and also isolating the x here, I also want to exclude x equals 7. So doing that with interval notations, so I can see that x can be any value less than 0, so we could say that is negative infinity to 0, but not including 0. And then the union with that could be any number between 0 and 7. So 0 to 7, again, not including the endpoints. And then another union, it could be any number larger than 7. So 7 to positive infinity. This would be our domain where we have excluded 0 and 7. 